Hey, what's going on, Facebook? Much love. Um, man, I, I want to share something with y'all right now. So, um, as I was driving, I was driving home. You know, we're we're going through this little bit of a, you know, rainstorm over here in Dallas, and um, I was driving, I was driving, and everything, and I'm passing this QT by this busy intersection, right? And um, I see a man standing on the side, you know, and he's got a sign and stuff like that, and my first my first instincts you know what i'm saying were like now he's just somebody trying to get a little bit extra cash to get some get some uh you know get some some beer money and stuff like that so again this is where my my flesh try to kick in and stuff but as i pass him as i'm driving i see uh i see a stack of clothes i see a suitcase i see some blankets and stuff like that and i could tell you know this this man was for real Anyway, long story short, so I pass him up, and I go about two, maybe about a mile and a half, two miles down, and I got to get some gas in my truck. And um, so you know, I uh, went ahead and did that, and I asked the lady that the at the, the cashier stand, I asked her if uh, if they do uh, cash back options, and she's like, yeah. So I told her, I said, you know what? I said, let me go ahead and do twenty dollars if I can get cash back for twenty dollars. She goes, okay. So I went on and did that. And the whole time the Holy Spirit was talking to me, go back to him, go back to him. I said, yes, Lord, I will. And the whole time I was driving down that way, I'm thinking, dang, it's going to be a busy intersection. How am I going to stop? So, and I just asked the Lord, I said, I said, Lord, just give me the right words to say to this man. And and I did. So, and I walked, I parked over at a, at a Sonic and I parked my truck and I just walked. And it was, it was, it was a pretty good pretty good walk but I, I don't care it is what it is you know i wanted to make sure i i took care of him so as i was walking to him he happened to notice me but you know what i'm saying like i kept walking to him i kept walking to him and i looked at him and he smiled one of the biggest smiles that i've ever seen you know and he just smiled big almost like you know just good to know that somebody had stopped to actually talk to him and i said i looked at him i said i said hey my brother i said um i said uh how's your day going today he's like man it's you know it's crazy but but god god lives and you know god is good and i said amen and i said well uh i got something to tell you he goes what's that he's i he said i told him i said i was driving and uh i didn't know how to talk to you before because you know this intersection is so crazy he goes okay i told him uh god told me to turn back around and come tell him to talk to you and uh he wanted me to bless you and he just smiled so big and I asked him what was going on. He says, well, me and my mother and my dog, you know, he pointed over there at this abandoned uh, building. And he goes, uh, we're right now, we don't have any place to live. And he pointed, I saw his uh, his mother and she was in a, in a in like in a blanket and they're just sitting over there. And I knew, and it's cold over here, actually, as a matter of fact. So I'm over here waiting. And uh, and I told him, I said, you know what? So I want to I wanna bless you with this money. I said, I don't know what your situation is, but, but I want to bless you. And I blessed him with 20 bucks. And I told him, I said, uh, I said, God loves you, regardless, whatever your situation going through, God loves you. And he wants me to tell you that whatever it is that y'all are going through, that he's going to shelter you and he's going to continue to love you. And he, he just seeks your heart right now. And I told him that and he just, he was smiling and he just gave me a hug. And I said, I want to pray for you. And I, and I prayed for him right there in the middle of a busy intersection. You know what I'm saying? And I prayed for this man. And I prayed for his family. This is over a situation. And I just told him, I said, uh. I said, God loves you. And uh, and I said, uh, and I pray that whatever situation this is, I said, that no weapon formed against you, my brother, is going to prosper. I told him, and he was, he was, he was saying, you know, even as a, he told me this, even as a believer, he says, I know that God will get me through this. And I felt so revived after that for, you know, listening. And it made me feel so good. So, brothers and sisters, I just asked today that you pray over this man and his family and his situation his name is tony if y'all can keep him in y'all's prayers today and uh just help uplift him please y'all i pray that in uh in jesus name that that we all come together as a, as a church one body one accord and we pray over over this man and his situation y'all so so uh i love y'all and uh god bless you y'all have a great day uh rain or, rain or storm or shine or whatever you know what god's still gonna prevail all right salute y'all one love Brother Vessel.